I think he's been gaining a little bit of velocity and obviously gaining better feel as he goes. So, you know, it's still a process for him. We're still getting used to being on the mound, but, you know, hopefully it's not, uh, yesterday was a good you know, step in the right direction. Do you still expect to see him in the rotation in September? I hope so. He's working his way towards it. You know, that's the goal. Um, you know, I think as he gets as he gets more comfortable on the mound, I think you'll see the velocity and the crispness of the pitches get better, and, you know, that's what we're hoping. A little so. slower than you thought at this point? Well, he's had some setbacks, of course, but, you know, Scott, such, he's such a good worker, and he's, you know, he's so dedicated to coming back this year. I mean, it's been impressive to watch him work, so we're hopeful that he comes back and helps us. Does he still have time to do that? I mean, with the minor league season? He does, yeah, sure. Yeah, it does get more complicated as the season draws to a close, but I mean, there's probably some ways we can get you know get around that a little bit. And it has to be long, simulated games or something. We can do that, but um, our hope is certainly that he can he can make it back. Right. He's had a, quite an uneven uneven rehab with the weather and then the exactly. I mean, it, the Florida State League's been a frustration, not to, you know for him and for our prospects. This has been you know, rain out after rain out, and guys can't get in a rhythm and. We got pitchers working on seven, eight days rest, so I don't think that's helped Scott's progression.